ideal writing environment is like not writing because I'm always because <laughs> I always have to drag myself to the computer. I am very disciplined. Uh, I would say probably my home office because that's when I'm there. I, I know I have to work. Um, I don't write in coffee shops really because I get too distracted. I'm like looking at the pastries or listening to other people's conversations. Um, so really my best writing environment is in my office where I have no excuses and I, I know that I have to get to work. When it comes to magazines, I don't like anybody to read my magazine before I do. So like when my magazines come, I hide them until I'm finished reading them and only then will I put them out on the coffee table. Like and my husband's always saying, do you think everybody else is going to absorb the information out of this? <laughs> you can't read it. It's just like this weird thing. It's like no one can read my magazine before I do. This is so silly, but like I have to pay my taxes quarterly and you have to send them in certified mail. And so they come back this green card that lets you know that your taxes <laughs> were accepted. And I love those. They're just a great size and, and, and I, just, I just, I save them just for bookmarks. My favorite bookstore right now is Flyleaf Books in Chapel Hill because it's my hometown independent bookstore and it's been such an asset to our community. Um, and I get to see so many of my friends now when they come through on tour, which is amazing. My favorite library is the Chapel Hill Public Library, which I grew up going to every Saturday with my parents and checking out as many books as I was allowed. And now I take my own daughter there on the weekends.